えー、本日はあの暑い中集まっていただきましてありがとうございます。あのそれでは早速ですが、あの第二四半期のですね、えー、結果について、えー、説明いたします。Firstly, I would like to show you our results for the first half year of 2015. In this period, we have achieved net sales of 821.1 billion yen, 109% of the same period the previous fiscal year. An operating income of 69.7 billion yen, an ordinary income of 74.4 billion yen, and a net income of 52.1 billion yen. All of which show increases in sales and income compared to the same period the previous fiscal year. Profit structure improvements are progressing in each business segment. As an overview, Developed markets showed market recovery with some stable markets and continued the trend to increased income and profitability in each business. For emerging markets, markets continued in a slump with currencies continuing to weaken, but we maintained results of the standard of the previous fiscal year. I will now summarize the company's overall motorcycle business. For developed markets, unit sales increased from 220,000 units to 240,000 units, thanks to the effect of new products. Net sales increased from 120.2 billion yen to 152.6 billion yen. Due to the effect of increased income and structural reforms, operating income returned to profitability from a loss of 5.6 billion yen to a surplus of 4.3 billion yen. Bringing the business into profitability in the second quarter as well. For emerging markets, unit sales in Indonesia have dropped significantly due to the effect of a market slump, decreasing to 2.3 million units from the 2.73 million units previously. Net sales were 365.6 billion yen, up from 361.2 billion yen. Operating income. Was 14.4 billion yen, down from 16.8 billion yen, therefore maintaining the standard of the previous fiscal year. In developed markets, unit sales in Europe increased to 123,000 from 108,000, and in North America increased from 38,000 to 48,000 units. Increased competitiveness from the effect of new products and structural reforms. Saw increased income and profitability, which continued through the second quarter, bringing operational profitability. In the ASEAN markets, unit sales in Indonesia have dropped significantly to 920,000 from 1.33 million units previously. Vietnam and the Philippines grew, with increases in Vietnam to 320,000 units from 290,000 units, and the combined total from the Philippines and Malaysia increased. To 170,000 units from 150,000. In addition, the platform model ratios for Indonesia, Thailand, and Vietnam increased from 32% in the first quarter to 34% in the second quarter. And through the increase of these platform models and increased sales of products in the higher price range, these markets maintained the standard of the previous fiscal year. In India. We achieved domestic sales of 255,000 units, down from 260,000 units. Export units fell to 78,000 from 88,000 units. However, we continue to maintain high market share levels in the high price range and are working on expanding sales with new product launches. I will now explain about our marine business. Net sales of outboard motors increased to 97.5 billion yen from 87.9 billion yen. In terms of other products, each category showed increased sales. The operating income ratio of the overall marine business increased to over 20 percent at 23.3 percent. I will now explain the state of our recreational vehicle business. From the effects of these types of new products, the ATV ROV net sales were 30.1 billion yen, up from 27.0 billion yen. For the second half year, we will continue to progress with our preparations to launch new products as our long-awaited entry into the full sports category. 
In terms of our intelligent machinery business, net sales showed an increase to 24.4 billion yen, up from 19.9 billion yen. In February this year, we were able to incorporate business from another company, and we announced the construction of a new business base. I will now explain the state of our smart power vehicle business. European exports have increased to full-scale operation, being 112% of the same period the previous fiscal year. And in the SPV business segment, net sales were up to 12.8 billion yen from 11.8 billion yen. From now on, we will roll out product groups fitted with the new green core technology, such as that shown in the photo. Finally, I will explain about the budget for this year. In terms of the business results, we will maintain the initial plans. The decreased income due to the downturn of sales in the emerging markets motorcycle business will be absorbed by increased income in the marine business. We believe that we will reach the targets of the current medium-term management plan. As we progress throughout the year, we are focusing on further increases of brand power and the earning power of each business segment as we work towards becoming a unique company that continues to achieve dynamic milestones in the next medium-term plan.